Welcome back. In this video, we'll talk about the terminology of movement disorders. Starting with chorea, this is a sudden, strong, jerk-like movement that can be best described as someone throwing something away. We see this in basal ganglia disorders and Huntington syndrome. Next, we have myoclonus. And this is a sharp, sudden, weak movement. It's almost like a shock or a sudden vibration of any muscle. And this can present as hiccups. We see this in hepatorenal syndrome. Next, we have dystonia, which is a sudden contraction of any muscle and sustain of that contraction. This commonly presents in the hand, as writer's hand, or in the eyelids, with constantly closed or open eyes. Next we have athetosis, and this is a slow, breathing-like movement. It mainly affects small muscles in the hand, and we see it in basal ganglia disorders and Huntington syndrome. Next we have tremors, and this can be subdivided into essential, resting, and intentional. Essential tremor is highly familial, and family history is almost confirmative, and it occurs mainly when somebody tries to change their posture. Interestingly, it decreases with alcohol intake or bitter blockers. Resting tremors occurs at rest, and again, it mainly involves either the neck or the fingers. If it involves the fingers, it can be described as pill rolling, and we see it almost exclusively in Parkinsonism. Intentional tremors are tremors that occur when somebody tries to move their muscles. Mainly the upper limbs, especially if they try to reach something far away. And we see this in cerebellar disorders. And here's a small quiz. What is the cause of the following movements? And here are the answers. Alright guys, that's all I have. Hopefully this helps and thank you so much for watching.